quarantine day five, six, seven, who knows, nor does it matter. Um, I got a little bored and it took longer than it should have to turn on this damn scale for one and um, do a mango salsa. So first we're gonna go off by measuring. So that way you guys know exactly how much. I used half of a purple onion. Is this purple or red? Purple, red? Because I've heard people say red, but are those different? Who knows? Sure. Anywho, so I have four ounces exactly of that. And then my mango looks like this. Mind you, my hands are little, but we have a señor that comes and he drip, uh, he brings fruit and all sorts of goodies. And he just made his weekly visit to us. So we're a little spoiled in that way. For mango, and I cut the whole thing minus a few little things that I, you know, ate myself. The boyfriend and the mother. But... With the mango, ounces wise, is 13.6 ounces of mango. Cilantro. Oh my goodness. Cilantro is 0.7 ounces of cilantro. Then we're gonna have tomato. And that is 4.3 ounces of tomato. <laughs> and then I'm not sure if I wanna add the actual um, avocado yet. Chile Serrano, I think. Mom! Este era serano, el, el chile. El chile qué? Serano, era serano? Sí. Okay. Point serano. three. Serano. 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 I know I'm going to get ripped to shreds. All right. Anywho, on that. I don't know if I want to add um, flow ounces, right? With the juice of the lemon. Yeah. Okay. So, you know. Gotta, gotta add it. Got this lemon from my backyard this morning. That's already one ounce of lemon juice. One point six. Gotta get every single little drop. Still, 1.6. Wah. All right. Whoopsies, I threw it away instead of putting it in the compost. So, I'm going to add that onto it. And we are going to toss it. Right? And then see if I need... Any more colors, any more. I almost want to say just throw in the avocado. I think I'm going to do that. Just do the avocado. All right. And so the avocados, they're not that great that the señor brought. But we chose the best kind and ended up getting 6.8 ounces of avocado so it could be like a guac salsa pico de gallo type of thing like no se hagan malos Ooh, that's actually kind of pretty huh yep. all right now seasoning wise it's always hard because aquí son bien salados but i'm okay with just simple so I'm going to start off with onion powder. No, cumin. Salt and pepper. Pepper. Oy. 
think that should be good, no? I don't want to add too much because what if the... No, no. You're going to have the boyfriend taste it as we go. Are you going to get a chip? Okay, so I'll get a little bit of everything. Handle that. Uh, what about cumin? Paprika? Garlic powder? <laughs> yeah? A ver. So half a teaspoon of... That seems like a little bit. We'll do. Huh? A little bit? Alright, what about paprika? Or chile cayenne? Well, we already have the serrano, huh? Alright, what about onion powder? Yeah. Okay. Onion powder and garlic powder, they're different. We have both, all right? And then we, Jesus. All right. Do we want to add pepper to it? No. Okay, that's what I was thinking too. Mix it all up. I'm wondering if I should add a little more lime to it. Did it taste zesty? Did it, what did it taste like? I guess I should taste it to see what. If you even want to, you know, for like a summer type of spring vibe, you know, because Easter's canceled, people. Um, you can even add pepino, really, for the crunch. Or sandia. I've seen it done with it. So, let us taste test this. Wow. A little bit of the onion and cilantro. Mm. Mm -mm. It needs um, a tad more salt. And a little more of the little ones, right? I don't have lime. I don't have a lime tree. That would be best. For this recipe, where is my but? And then we can't leave the house, or shouldn't be leaving the house. And I think that's gonna do the trick right there. And there you have it. Really, all you need is whatever type of seasoning you would like for your house. Some people like spicy. I can't handle it, my gosh, right it. But there you have it. Sorry for the lighting. We're gonna enjoy this for dinner. Until next time for another recipe.